Good morning. It is December 2nd. <sighs> okay. So last week was super busy. And this is a Monday. Did I mention that? Again, another busy day. I got a tutorial going up today, which normally is a vlog day, but I gotta edit the vlog still. Because <laughs> busy. The pop-up shop I think was pretty successful. There's gonna be a lot of orders coming in throughout the week and drummed up a lot of interest, which is good. And a lot of people took business cards because they wanted custom stuff, so that's great. Friendsgiving was a success. Thanksgiving was a success. I spent all of Sunday basically just in bed resting. I, I just like literally ate leftovers in bed and watched YouTube videos yesterday and napped and dozed. We were off to Natchitoches today because friends got a doctor's appointment and then we're going to do a little shopping, a little Christmas shopping maybe. I don't know. We're going to have some lunch for sure. You can tell I look so tired, don't I? I tried to put on a little makeup today kind of make myself look a little awake. But mm. anyway, it's super cold today, so I'm bundled up in a really heavy sweater. Hopefully I don't get hot. Just a quick outfit of the day. Just holy sweater. Sister got me from Rue 21 like three, four years ago. I don't even know. It's warm and comfortable and cozy and it's pretty cold today, so. And yeah, this is today's outfit. I was realizing, looking in the mirror, just how much I look like my mom. I am the goth version of my mom. It's happened. I have become her. Not that I'm mad about it. It's just one of those things that's like funny. They always say, you turn into your mom. You do. Even if it's the goth version, you do. Wednesday, I think. Is it Wednesday or Thursday? It's Thursday. Oh, my hair looks like crap. 
uh, ignore the hair. I just kind of like rough blow dried it. I didn't really style it or anything, but yeah, we'll just do this to kind of hide the worst of it. It's been a busy week. I've been doing a lot of like editing behind the scenes work, and then yesterday we went, I had to go do some stuff for the uh, business that I work for. I normally just handle social media, website, PR, the whole, the, the tech side of it, like all the online presence, that kind of stuff, that's, that's my, my gig, right? Well, there's a, a pretty big event coming up, which is called um, Winter Fet. They do downtown here in Alexandria, and it's like a big deal. Like people come from out of town for it. And within there, you can have vendors and booths and stuff. So they're going to have a booth. So me and <laughs> Lila have been over there yesterday cutting leather, punching holes and doing the patterns, like cutting out the pattern to stitch together to make leather goods. This is my first time ever cutting leather, using a scalpel, anything like that. I may not have a future in it, I don't know. I, I had a couple duds that I throw out. But since it's my first time ever doing it, I did get five patterns completely done to be stitched together of a, a dragonfly keychain. I know, it's nothing big, but for my first go, I think I did okay. And uh, she's doing Christmas stockings that are made of leather. So if you didn't know, the company I work for is a leather, bespoke leather goods company. Which I know isn't gonna be everybody's cup of tea. Okay, so it's time to go get to work. I started to do a video last night and just was not in it. Low energy, meh. So I just didn't. <laughs> I've just been tired and my body hurts. <laughs> my hand hurts. My, my thumb hurts. This hurts. And I may be having to go work tomorrow. So hopefully this feels better by tomorrow. But yeah, just did this look, which is winter berry inspired by Bolty Soaps, Katie Carson, you and that scrapey scrapey, that big containy wheel. I had to do a makeup look in your honor because I love you so much. Enjoy your channel. So yeah, that's what's up today. And I think we're just gonna have a girls night this evening. I'm probably gonna get lunch with my husband first. He's going to work and then we're gonna do girls night over at another friend's house. Uh, yesterday we worked all day and then got Chinese. And then I got my Christmas stuff out of storage. I was gonna do a video though when I got home last night, like, in, but I was just, I was exhausted, man. I was done for the day. So I'm in between I'm packing Christmas stuff and packing up my Halloween Thanksgiving stuff still, which is all over the floor in here. This next week is gonna be insane. So this is what, Saturday now. We're having girls night tonight. Tomorrow, I think I'm working, making some leather stuff tomorrow, probably. And then Monday, I think we're going Lafayette. We're gonna be going Lafayette just to do some Christmas shopping and looking around, whatever. I think she wants to go check out stage there. I'll be doing some work during the week and then preparing for Indie Fet, which is Friday and Saturday. Which I gotta go make a post for today and get that live. And I got finding time to edit videos too in between here and upload and try to write a blog post. I'm a little frazzled this week, but I enjoy it. I like being busy. I like having something to do. Feels good. But yeah, you guys like my background. I like it. I think it looks pretty. I like it much better. The tree was so cute, but it was so it was too small. It wasn't enough back there. And I think this little sign and the bowl of ornaments looks nice. I'm just gonna import this footage now and maybe work on some editing.
happy Monday. I'm doing a two week vlog because I didn't really have enough footage to do a whole one last week. It was just me mostly fussing about being tired and busy. So I'm combining two weeks worth of footage and it'll probably be way long now, knowing me. Last three weeks have been super busy and it's culminating in this weekend being the busiest because it's winter fit, indie fit, all that stuff that we're preparing for with the other business I work for. So it's kind of, you know, Christmas time's busy time. Lots of events and stuff that you gotta have a booth at and all that kind of shit. Anyway, this is my makeup today. I just did some kind of soft glam. We're going to Lafayette today to do some Christmas shopping. Nothing too exciting. I just feel like getting up playing makeup this morning. I didn't film it or anything like that. Just played it, just playing it. And my lips is NARS Do Me Baby. And the eyes is chocolate gold bar palette. Hair's a little messy, outfit's a little, it's very casual. And I'm wearing my other glasses today. Another company reached out to me though to do an unboxing video with their glasses. So I was like, okay, I'm, I'll do it, sure. I like glasses and I need them to see. So I like the idea of having more than one pair. Okay, so good morning vlog. It has been a busy few weeks. So yeah, Monday we went to Lafayette. That was pretty fun. It was a nice day. I went with Lila and her mom, who was adorable. We went to Kato's, Stage, Kohl's. I really liked Kohl's. Uh, we don't have a Kohl's in my town. And, uh... We went to World Market, also love World Market. Oh my gosh, I could spend hours and thousands in there. <laughs> Too many cool things. The home decor, oh my gosh. And yeah, where else did we go? Went to World Market, oh, Bed Bath & Beyond. I used to really like Bed Bath & Beyond, but I don't know, I feel like it's kind of boring in there now. Like, I don't know. I don't like their decor, just everything looks kind of tacky. It's like they haven't kept up with the trends really there. Then we went to the Asian market. We had lunch at a place called Ground Pat Patty, but I was able to get a um, bunless patty there, bunless hamburger, and a salad, and a sweet potato. I know I messed up because I got a sweet potato, but damn it I love sweet potatoes. And I didn't know I liked them until recently. Now I really know I like them and that's all I want to eat. I know they're not like they have good stuff in them. But they're also full of sugar and carbs. <laughs> which my body does not enjoy. My mouth enjoys those things. Yesterday, which was Tuesday, we were supposed to do groceries and this and that. We just ended up uh, going to get Chinese. <laughs> going to eat Chinese and... Stopping by the bar and visiting with Lila and bringing her hot chocolate and going to Starbucks. Or well, Starbucks before that. And that is what we did yesterday. Then we came home and went to bed early. And I got up at four, made some coffee, did the dishes, kind of did a little tidy up around the house, washed my hair, and started filming. And I've done a full makeup tutorial already today, and now I'm getting ready for a second time just to go to work. Because the look I did was just too much, a little too much to, for the leather shop, okay? It was a lot going on, and I just didn't feel like going around all day in a lot of makeup. It's incredibly cold. I just want to put on a cozy hoodie and work. So I'm just doing something soft right now. I just picked up this palette from Went Wild, which is like a dupe of the Soft Glam palette. So I just want to play with the transition shade in it, basically and do something with that in the crease and that's about it it is so cold today i think it's like 40 something but the wind chill or whatever said 37 weekend's gonna be what's super busy is winter fit indie fit we'll be having a booth inside indie fit village at winter fit <laughs> so i had to make a graphic up for that you know and all kinds of stuff and helping out Talking to customers, and it's gonna be a lot. It's gonna be two days, it's gonna be the 13th and 14th, all day. I think we're only gonna do half day Friday and then all day Saturday. 
But it's going to be really cool because there's going to be bands and stuff playing and lots and lots of people. People come from the, all over the state to this. So it's going to be a, kind of a big event. It's going to be a lot of fun and I'm really, really excited to get to spend the whole day there. There's going to be ice skating, like all kind of really cool shit. And though I'm not going to get to do a lot of that stuff because I'm going to be, you know, working, but technically I'll still get to hang out and see people and talk to people. But figured since I haven't been having much time to vlog or anything, I would go ahead and while I'm getting ready today, talk to you guys. Oh, and yeah, my hair. Looks kind of weird, doesn't it? I actually tried to fade out the overtone just to see what would happen, because I was kind of like, eh, I'm thinking I might be over it, I don't know. Well, I faded it. I used uh, just dish soap to kind of, because it's heavy in sulfates, to wash it. I did it a few times. It didn't destroy my hair at all. Like, I did a lot of conditioner. My hair feels great still. But it turned it this like really bizarre yellowy amber honey color. So that's what the look I did before this was a very dramatic kind of like gold honey look. Kind of futuristic looking. It was just a very dramatic look though. So tomorrow morning I'm going to film a drugstore soft glam look. It's because I did one that was very like in depth soft glam and it was all kind of high end stuff. I feel like it's not like fair to do one that's like drugstored drugstore themed as well. That brush is really scratchy and is not comfortable. You know, I don't have the soft glam palette from ABH. I really want it, but if I have this, do I really need it? No, but I still want it. I figured I'd get ready and talk to you guys and get two bird stoned at once. Yeah, this looks nice. This is a really good palette. Is, yeah, what is this actually called? The Glamour Squad from Wet n Wild. It's fucking good, dude. I love it. I'm mean, always well, the first time I'm using it, but so far I love it. The mattes are blending magnificently. Like, where was this quality in the Rebel Rose eyeshadows? Do a light look, I said. Not do much makeup. You know what happens? Let's sit down and I start playing. I'm bubbling just a little bit of eyeliner. I'm really loving this uh, Flash Cat Eye the L'Oreal Infallible. It's really good. I haven't used this stencil. But I just I really like the liner itself. Very comparable to Tattoo Liner or the Fenty Liner. Very easy to use and incredibly long wearing. And we're going to try to do like some live videos this weekend from downtown for the yeah, business or for. So that's what we have the gimbal to do. And we're going to try to test it out today, I think, and see how it works. And just do more work today. I kind of don't want to do a whole lot with my hands because my hand hurts really bad. I do have like really bad arthritis and I did not know. That this would make it flare up so bad, but it did. So I've been kind of really hurting the last couple of weeks too. On top of everything, I've had like just back pain, shoulder pain, hand pain. I don't know. I aggravated my shoulder a while back again. And now like carpal tunnel is acting up and just everything hurts. <laughs> my feet hurt. My foot particularly hurts. One of them, but they both hurt. My ankle hurts. It's just a lot and... I'm very frustrated with the amount of pain I'm in right now because I got a lot of stuff I want to do and I'm sick of it trying like feeling it's holding me back because that's what it does it feels like it holds me back a lot and like I don't want it to like I want to just go do what I want and feel free but you're like trapped in your own body and like ugh, and moisturizer on some new moisturizer I'm testing out from Fountain of Youth, which is Juliana Rancic's brand, is her name? This is your like real clean and nice. This is a moisturizing souffle with SPF something in it. So far, I quite like it. It's, it's really nice for daytime. It's very lightweight. I know even when I do like a light eyeshadow look, I still do my eyes first. Don't ask. It's just my process. So I, I guess I was productive yesterday because I did my product pictures. Got two things uploaded. To YouTube. So it wasn't like I didn't do anything. I just felt like I didn't do anything. Which I made up for today because I got up stupid early today. 10, 3.50. 3.50 a.m. Me and my husband both. Time to get up. 
We both just woke up. I think he was sniffly. Yeah, we had both taken melatonin, which usually kicks our butts, but it did not. Like, we would sleep quickly, but woke up really early. Usually he has trouble waking up early when he takes the melatonin. Okay, just finished up the scan. I had to go, what do you call it? Export footage. <laughs> Didn't even forget, but it's cold. Still a little age rewind under here. So we could all use to rewind some age. This is still just a favorite concealer. This is it for my makeup today. I'm gonna go make my coffee to go. Put my shoes on and yeah, I'll check in later. Hey pumpkin, do you think you're a kitty cat? Huh? Do you think you're a kitty cat sitting on the table? How do you think you are? Tables for glasses, not asses. Funyun, you don't even care. No cares. I'm busy. You know, you're facing the windows like you like to do. I understand you getting up here to look out the window because you're short, but you're just looking at the wall. Oh, you're looking over there. You know I'm about to leave, huh? Here you go. This is where you need to hang out today, okay? Nice and warm on your blankets. Yeah. And outfit of the day. So classy, right? These are some velour cozy pants that I got at Target last winter. And they are amazing because they are so warm and so comfy. And just so comfy. And this is just a black t-shirt and a cropped hoodie. Also from Target. This is my, it is super cold today and I'm gonna be working but I need to be kind of warm but also really comfy got pockets so I like that and just some tennis shoes okay so I actually didn't have to work today I did have to come home and work on editing which I did for a few hours and then I uh, and I couldn't keep my eyes open so I took a nap which is much needed and really nice and now I have a nap face <laughs> so I slip on one side and now it is grocery time. Well, dinner and grocery time. So, just waiting for my husband to get home so we can go get all that done. It's so exciting. Tomorrow's definitely a full day of work and I'm gonna film in the morning again, like I did the day because I was super productive, and I'm gonna edit in the evening. So I may get some more editing done this evening. After groceries, I'm not sure. I'm gonna try. But I just want to go get me some chicken and eat because I'm hungry now. Good late morning, early afternoon. It's 11 something. Hey, just filmed a drugstore glam look. This is it. All finished. And I uh, realized I don't have any winter hats or anything really that warm. So I'm going to have to go to Walmart tonight and find me a winter hat. to looks like I need a little bit. Anyway, I also didn't have a drugstore red lipstick except for like two and they weren't quite the right tone, but I mean, we made one of them work. Anyways, about to go to work at the shop, finishing up stuff for tomorrow and Winter Fet and Indie Fet. Winter Fet's the big event, Indie Fet is within it. <laughs> it's Indie Fet Village, which is in Winter Fet, and that's where like all the vendors are and stuff and all the uh, bands play. Like there's gonna be a metal block, it's gonna be freaking cool this year. I'm really excited. Lots of bands lined up and like yeah there's a whole like stage just for metal and I'm like hell yeah. So we should have a pretty decent metal scene especially in Louisiana. We take our metal kind of serious. Our swamp metal as we call it. Uh, anyways 
I'm sitting on the couch with Pumpkin getting ready to go to work. I'm just waiting for my ride. Waiting for Lila. Because <laughs> we were actually working together on this in the shop stuff. Cutting the patterns and all that. And I'm hoping I don't have to hammer too many holes today. Because I don't think my little hand... I got lipstick on my hand. I don't think my carpal tunnel can handle it, honestly. So I'm like so wound up on cold brew though. I've drank so much cold brew today. So much stuff got me a go cup full of it ready to go too. And you know, I didn't go to sleep last night at all. I don't know, it's probably at least 11, almost midnight. I laid there in red for a long time. And didn't really sleep, I don't feel like that good. Like I keep having like weird dreams and stuff. It's been happening lately. My hair's gotten kind of long, eh? Yeah. It's finally getting some length on it. Ugh. But anyway, yeah, weird dreams all night. And then I uh, woke up, my husband left for like a second, and then I dozed back off and then woke up at 6, just like right on the dot at 6 a.m. Ready to get up, and I was like, well, we could lay here a little while and doze and waste the day, or we could actually get up and get a video filmed and get some work done, which is what I did. So yeah, whole video recorded. Uh, one is edited, I just have to put in some pictures. So I'm gonna get that uploaded tonight and finished. I already have one uploaded tonight and ready to be posted tomorrow. I'm getting really fast with the editing. It's not taking me four hours to edit a video anymore. I can do it in like an hour or <laughs> 30 minutes sometimes, depending. Which is awesome that it's not taking me a million years. Why is the front of my shirt wet? But yeah, anyways, me and the little funny and are just sitting here. She's snugging in my lap. So I give her some cuddles. I just had to turn her blanket off so she's sad because I'm leaving. She's going to be sad because I'm leaving anyway. I need to turn the heat up before I go. <laughs> my makeup is probably a lot today for the leather shop, but I mean, it's just going to be me and Lila there today. It doesn't matter. Nobody's going to be seeing us. There may be some customers coming in, but who cares? I don't. But yeah, I think this look came out pretty. We got some glitter. We got some gold shimmer. And it is all like really accessible drugstore, not ColourPop or BH Cosmetics affordable makeup. It's straight up, you can go to CVS and buy this stuff, like that kind of drugstore. Cold today, it's gonna be super cold this weekend, so I definitely need to get like a, a winter hat or something, like a, a, foot, a stocking cap. I have one, but it's really cheapy and thin. I think I got like at the Dollar Tree. So I'm gonna see if I can get Rossi to take me to the Walmart tonight, the big one and find me some winter stuff, at least a hat. <laughs> yeah, I can hide this mop. Okay, so I got some clarifying shampoo and some vitamin C tablets. So I don't have a like mortar and pestle to like grind up the vitamin C tablets and I couldn't find them in capsules or anything. So what I'm going to do is, these right here, I'm gonna put them in my, I have a like smoothie maker thing and it has a setting for like grinding coffee and stuff. I'm gonna pop some of that and grind these bitches up and powder them. And I'm gonna mix, or I think you mix it water, make like a paste, and that'll lighten your hair. And I also got some, this was recommended, like clarifying shampoo. I don't see how that could do better than Dawn uh, dish soap, but okay. And I got some new conditioner. It's made with coffee, so. You know I had to have it. Even my hair needs coffee. <laughs> this is um, Herbal Essence. I'm really into like the Herbal Essence's new stuff, the bio-renewal collections. But yeah, this one is made with real botanicals. Yeah, this one's coffee fruit. I haven't smelled it. I didn't even smell it. Ooh. Oh, that smells good. It doesn't smell like coffee. But that's a whole nother smell of beautifulness. Oh my God, I love it. I thought it was going to smell like coffee, but it doesn't. It smells beautiful. I don't know. It smells really good. I think all these new herbal essences smell really good, and I've been using them like crazy. I really like the Moroccan one, the Moroccan argan oil. It smells really nice. It has kind of a spicy smell to it that I love. Hey, really bad lighting. Yeah. Bad lipstick. Check. So, the majority of the day, I actually ended up learning to sew. <laughs> Because normally, you know, I learn to punch holes in the leather and do cutting. Today, we learned to sew. And I made a koozie. 
like I've never sewed really in my life before so it was a little bit of a, a struggle but we made a bunch of the bottoms today and then this is the first full koozie I've put together I've just done like the pieces to go in the inside earlier today to learn and yeah brought it home and just finished up all the go but this is a koozie that you put a soda in or a beer or whatever and it keeps it nice and cool and happy so yeah pretty proud of myself for finishing this up and getting it good and here's the one that Lila made she did really good too so yeah that was our project today because we were just kind of basically trying to help out but also learn while we help out <sighs> my hands hurt so bad I've got a blister <laughs> uh, yeah we took a, a break though and got dinner and Walmart because I needed to get the winter hat and I got one actually well I thought I was gonna go to Target to get it but we we're closer to Walmart so we just ran over there oh and I only chipped one nail the rest of them are fine here's the little fur jacket I got <laughs> it's so cute and it's got the little ring hook I was looking at these at Kohl's wanting one so bad and just didn't get one because they were kind of expensive they were you know like 30 40 dollars this was 20 at Walmart so hell yeah and I got a nice little hat to wear with a poof. And I got some gloves that I can use while I'm on my phone. And they're kind of elegant and nice looking and classy. But they got the little things you can actually, you know, mess with your phone. Because I didn't have a pair you could do that with. I actually don't have a whole, like, winter, winter stuff because it does not get that cold here. To usually need it, but we're going to be outside, like, all day. Be outside all day in the cold, so I actually <laughs> need wintertime stuff. So I think we're gonna go there on noon tomorrow. We're leaving, so right now I'm gonna go take a bath and go to bed. Ready to go hang out in the cold. I might zip this up if I get too cold. This is so cute. I love this little jacket in my hat. But I got my little Christmas earrings on, it's a very Christmassy makeup, and yeah. We're ready. Yeah, I did a get ready with me doing this look, so that'll be in a video. <laughs> Today's makeup, I threw this on in record time. Like the probably the fastest I've ever done a makeup look, and I actually wasn't even intending to do that much makeup. I'm just wearing a long sleeve t-shirt right now and a pair of leggings, but I'm probably gonna switch to a Christmas shirt later where I look like a little Santa elf. But okay, so this is what we got today, and I'll hopefully get some footage and stuff from today and check in. But it's kind of busy and you never know. But yeah, I gotta go finish getting ready. <laughs>